more than 7,000 islands, the Philippine archipelago is rich with a diverse flora and fauna. It is definitely a spectator of how God is noble in His creation. The Philippines undeniably shows its capacity as a great producer of different landform harvests. Its leading agricultural proceeds such as cocoa, lumber, and oil are obtained from coconut trees. From the tips of its digging and training roots up to its broad and lengthy leaves, nothing of these parts can be wasted and must not be wasted. In building matters, the trunk and tough leaves of the coconut tree is known for its durability, such as in constructing structural framework of houses and for other daily and recreational activities. In terms of fuel, the coconut shell is burned to produce charcoal, which is mainly used in cooking. Philippines is also an exporter of copra, a dried coconut meat that yields coconut oil. This copra industry, either minimal or extensive, is widely seen throughout the country. For wooden floors, the husk can also be used as floor polisher. Some barrio people can acquire the coconut just anywhere, while others can avail at the market. The coconut meat is grated to produce the cocoa milk or gata, which is a must in some native Filipino cuisines. It's fresh fruit, delicately called as butong, Filipinos have this habit to make these as a self-refresher, especially during outings and picnics. It is also popular for foreign tourists who are deprived of experiencing this kind of beverage. Sneaking in, there is also called tuba, a whiskey for native residents that comes from the fermented juice of the coconut. Sayongsong is also a delicacy from the Philippines that uses gata. Its sticky, smooth texture builds a feeling of satisfaction to those who eat this. Apart from being a simple drink, butong is mainly used as well for fruit salads and halo-halo, which is a native Filipino dessert. The coconut is just one of the native trees being seen almost everywhere that contributes to the bounty and beauty of the Philippines. Without a doubt, it is truly considered as the people's tree of life.